Aisha for Wanda TV. I'm at the uh, third demo day for Flex Six Labs, and I'm with uh, A Star Apps, one of the founders. If you introduce yourself, please, and uh, explain what A Star Apps is. Uh, I'm Mu'taz Suleiman, CEO of A Star Apps. Uh, at A Star Apps, we provide services and tools for developers to get his app beta tested in a very easy way and seamless way uh, by providing them with. Uh, First, by providing them with testers to beta test their apps, we provide them with global reach for beta testers from all over the world. They can reach, for, so for example, if they if they are launching an app in a global market, we provide them with global users from the markets that they want their, to launch their app in, uh, so that they can beta test their apps before they release it into the market. So how does this work, this uh, beta testing? Okay, uh, uh, we also provide them with uh, tools for beta testing so that uh, whenever they, uh, for, the, for the developer to send the app to the tester, to, they will be sending it over the air, they don't need to do any connections or anything, they just, they just uh, upload the app to our website and the tester download the app from our website, they don't need to do anything. And whenever the tester wants to send the feedback, which is what the, what's the most important which is the most important thing for the developer to hear from the to hear from the testers whenever the tester wants to send the feedback all the all, the, all what they need to do is just to shake the phone and they will get our feedback form. They don't need to do anything more. Can you give us a demonstration? Yeah, sure. Uh, you have another have another founder here. If you introduce yes. yourself, please. My name is Omar Gub. I'm a founder with Mortez. Let's see the demo. Okay, so we have an example app here. Yes. This is application we made. It's called yeah. Moto Rift. Yep. When you open the application and you're playing with it and mm -hmm. you want to send the feedback, just shake the phone and our feedback oh, is yeah. here. Okay. Title, comment. Yeah. You write anything. And here you write anything you want. Then you choose the, the, the severity here or here. Severity, okay. You get a screenshot, mm -hmm. you annotate it with things you want, and you press done. Once you press done, the mm -hmm. feedback is sent, and you can see it. Okay, we have it up here. Is it clear? So this is the website? Yes. Here's the website, here is the app profile. You could refresh the feedback. See the website from here? Okay. Here's the picture. Oh, here's the picture with all the circles. Yes. Excellent. You could see the severity and who sent it. And it's from an iPhone 4S yeah. with an iOS 5.1.1. And every description and the title, you could see it here. Yeah. Description and the title we wrote. And you could filter other feedbacks we sent before. Okay, that's cool. So, um, why would someone join up to be a tester on the website? Uh, for testers, uh, they will be testing apps to uh, get to know the, the new uh, upcoming apps, which might be interesting for them for early adopters, especially, but for other. Uh, Normal testers to be very interesting for them to uh, to test out the other people's apps because they will get an incentive of the testing their apps, where the developer will be paying testers uh, an agreed amount of money after the tester finishes testing the app. Okay. And uh, do you take a cut of this uh, fee? Yeah, actually, th that's our uh, main source of revenue, which is a 10% com commission from these fees that the developer pays for the testers. We just take 10% commission of this. And for a developer to um, register on your website, is that free or is there a fee? It's totally for free, and they can even use our whole website and all our services if they are uh, if they are testing with people they already know, like their friends and families and uh, this stuff. So they, it will be uh, very easy for them to set the price to zero, and in this case, we'll not be generating any revenue from those de developers, so that they can use and leverage our uh, services that we provide without paying anything. And how will you get this first batch of testers? Okay, uh, we've already launched our platform uh, 17 days ago, and uh, right now we're not providing the crowdsourcing features, so for a developer to get his app tested, he needs to invite those people who already know, like friends or families or other employees in the company. Uh, so in that case, we are building our uh, testers uh, database using our uh, de developers' network. So we just use our networks to build our own network of testers, to, uh, so that we, uh, when we launch our crowdsourcing feature, uh, we, we already have uh, 
testers uh, ready to, to test other people's apps. Also, we'll be uh, hiring full-time testers to work at our company uh, at the first few months to the, so that we can have testers already available uh, 24-7 to be testing any people's, uh, any developer's app. Okay, now, Omar, the, um, right now this is uh, on iPod and uh, iPhone. Yes, iOS. iOS. Yes. Uh, is it going to be on Android later? Yes, it's going to be Android in the official release that Matas mentioned in January uh, 2013. Okay. We'll be adding Android and we'll support Windows Phone. Right now it's totally operating on uh, uh, most of the iOS devices, which is iPod and the iPad and the iPhone, which we demonstrated right now. And in, as I mentioned, in January 2013, at our official global reach uh, release, it will be on uh, Windows Phone and Android. So the, the tar market, market you're targeting to start with will be the region and then globally or? Yeah, we'll start by, uh, by targeting the main region, uh, which is the, the local region for us here, by our beta, private beta. Uh, we'll be contacting companies uh, working on uh, apps in our region, uh, since they are uh, very few, so we can contact them each one in person because uh, we are still in private beta. But uh, during our public release, which will be uh, by the beginning of next year, uh, we'll be targeting global markets. Really? Well, as you know, I'm an ex-developer, and when I was yeah. a developer, I would have loved something like this. So I wish you all the best. Yeah. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you very much.